I am. In my bed, resting. Listening. Well, not listening, but watching yesterday's service. I videotaped it. But I videotaped myself in it. I didn't videotape the actual person. Ladies and gentlemen. That's why I want to do live, so it won't be that little thing there. It'll be big. So please subscribe to my YouTube channel. See, I stay sitting, you know, because I was sitting all before doing the service, right? So people just don't, maybe they do understand, but I really don't think people really understand my seriousness and passion towards Christ and, and towards service, you know? We come out to church to give God. The, we sing the song, which they don't even sing no more. Come out to give God the glory. They don't even sing that anymore. Uh-uh. An unsaved person used to sing that all the time. But that's what I mean, meant, when I was talking yesterday in my video, that all them good soul-stirring songs, they don't sing no more. They want to sing, come on and bless the Lord. They want to sing a lot of worship songs, and they don't even realize that in order to worship God, you have to be a worshiper. And in order to be a worshiper of God, you have to be, you know, you got to worship Him in spirit and in truth. So if you walk around here lying and you walk around here and your spirit ain't right, and your spirit ain't got no connection to God, then <laughs> your worship ain't going to be nothing. So it just, I it just, you know, I guess I kind of can say I take it personal because I ain't here to be playing. I ain't here to be impressing nobody. You see what I'm saying? When I go up there to lead the service, I go up there to lead the service to get something out of the service. So I go to church to get something from the Lord. I bring him with me. I take him back with me. I don't bring him and leave him. I don't come to church and pick him up. I have him with me already. I have him in my spirit. I have him in my soul. I have him in my mind. So when I get to church, I'm able to praise him. So we are at a place now. This corona is at a place now where 
God is confronting people. He he <laughs> wants to know where people stand with him. Because he already know. But he want people to see and put it that way. Since he already knows, so that's the wrong way of putting it. He want people to see where they stand with him. So he's confronting them now. Mm-hmm. He's allowing certain things to happen. I don't mean sicknesses and stuff like that. This corona. A lot of people don't got corona. A lot of saved folks don't got corona. A lot of people that went to church didn't got corona. Yes, there's some people that was church goers. There's some people that was, you know, going to church and got the corona and died. Okay. I'm not even talking about them. I'm talking about those that are still alive. That are still got the activity of their lamb, still in their right mind, still not. I mean, they may get a cough, they may sneeze, but nothing personal, nothing serious. He, we are at, they're at a place now where God wants to see. What's that word, Lord? Help me with that word. God want to see their reality. My grandmother and Bishop Mingo used to always say, there is a reality in serving God. See, I started singing the song again. I was feeling the song. But it seemed like nobody else was feeling it. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm telling you, whatever I do, I put my best foot forward and I never was one I never was one to do things to impress people never I may may like a boy I may have liked a boy and I may like how can I say it I may not try to impress them what's the word I'm looking for I may try to look good put on something nice you know, fix my hair real nice, you know, and when I pass him, you know, I may act a little different, you know, than I may have been acting before I came in the space where he is, but I don't try to impress him. I don't, he having a conversation, I don't try to, to impress him with my knowledge or if I went to college, I'd say, oh, yeah, I went to college. I learned this. No. You know, I, don't, I, I never was one like that. So I'm not going to do that with the Lord. You know, I'm not here to be impressed. How can I say it? I'm not here to impress others about him within me, you know. I'm here to do it through reality. I'm here to to serve him in a reality that's unknown to men. I'm I'm here to allow his glory to be glorified in me unknown to men. I'm here to do things to do the impossible. I'm here to to work out and produce miracles that people don't believe will ever happen. I'm here to say things that people never heard. I'm here to prophesy things that people never seen. That's the kind of work I want God to be doing in my life. I'm not here to repeat something that I heard somebody say. I'm not here to wear something that somebody else is wearing. I'm not here to look like somebody, you know, so people can see that I'm a part of them. No, I want to look and think about like God, you know, I want to have the mind of Christ. I don't want to be high minded than God. I don't want to feel like I'm so high minded that I can't be touched by God. You know, I want to be high minded in him. I want to be able to walk around and know <laughs> that I know what I'm talking about. And see, you can't speak too much about anything if you have not went through it. If you have not, if you have not experienced it, you know, if you have not 
you know, if you have not, um, well, I guess that's, that's the bottom line to it. If you have not been through it or if you have not experienced it, there's not too much you can say about it. You know what I'm saying? You can't say too much. You can speak on what somebody else say. You can repeat what somebody else say. But if you yourself have not personally experienced it, I personally encountered it, or even personally saw it, that ain't too much you could say. Okay, so I'm gonna end this video. <laughs> this is just a random video. And I gotta get ready, because this is our prayer week, so. Get ready and get to prayer. <coughs> Scare me. I just want to, I want the church to get back like it was. But, you know, get where, you know, the presence of God is just, the presence of God is just like in the place. 